we're on the Little Manatee River. It's about two and a half feet right here, according to the Garmin. Water temperature 65 degrees. Kind of cool, but uh, it said the bay was 69, but it was cool overnight at the water shelf. I put it at the Domino boat ramp. Really nice ramp. We're right by US 41 here. We're headed this way, right out that way. 41 is right over that way, right up. There was no one at the ramp. Okay, one person was at the ramp. Nobody at the nobody at the bait shop but me. Normally there's a long line there. They must have read the weather forecast, but if you look at the barometer, it was basically flat. So I said, I gotta go out. I gotta try it. If you wanna know where to get these really cool fish on net gators, there's gonna be a link on my site for Amazon. They're $19.99. They're some of the best I've ever used. We're coming up on the Little Manatee River Bridge here on US 41. It's straight ahead, right there. That's it. Little Manatee River Bridge, there's a train trestle. Just heading out. Believe it or not, it's 22 feet deep on the other side of that. There's a big hole, all full of oyster beds. And you see people fishing right along the tracks all the time, going after sheephead. Underneath the Little Manatee River Bridge, it's about 10 feet deep in the main channel, but it gets to be about 15, 18 feet right by the train trestle, then it's dredged out right there. And you would never think in the Little Manatee River, shallow as it is, that you're gonna find a 20 foot hole there. But it's about 100 feet by 100 feet. It's there. Lots of snags, but Everywhere you find snags, that's where the fish are. We're coming up on the Manatee River Bridge here. That's US 41 right there. Seven to eight feet underneath here. I've caught a lot of sheep in under here and a lot of mangrove snapper. You would never think it would be this deep in the little Manatee River. I'll try and get the main channel here. I'm going by my garment. See, even on the uh, on the chart, it's only showing you six feet, then there's a hole out here. Well, that hole is 20 feet deep. The best fishing I've had is, is around it. Park on the other side of it and cast into it. Cast right along the edge of the railroad trestle right there. Look at this. Look at this deep drop off right here. Right on the garment. Nine feet, 11 feet, 13 feet. There's that big hole right there. 14 and a half, 16, 17, 19 feet, so tides down a good foot and a half. The deep hole is a big area. The control for grouper in this little spot. I bet, I bet we pick one up in the fall. Not legal, but not bad. Beautiful looking mangrove, little Manatee River. Very nice fish. Manatee River mangrove snapper. Be careful not to get your uh, your finger in their uh, mouth. That's how they get their name snapper. So off he goes, about a seven inch. Liam, here's another one. Here. See what this is. Oh, another snapper. Another snapper. That's another uh, Manatee River mangrove snapper. Look at that. See those teeth on that guy? Look at that. Just a beautiful fish. Beautiful. Look at that. Look at the color on him. Look at that. Excellent fish. Oh. Excellent fish. Just beautiful. They gotta be 10 inches. So we're gonna let him go. Come on, guy. Number size one hook. That's it. Look at that snap. That's why they call them snappers. Off you go. Catch you in another year. We're under the US 41 bridge in uh, Ruskin on the Little Manatee River here. Had to get out of the heavy winds by the mouth. Right for sheephead mangroves. Oh, oh. 
snapper. Look at that. Very nice. Very nice fish. Look at that. That's a beautiful fish. I'm put him on the scale. I don't think he makes it though. They have to be 10 inches. Nope. He doesn't make it. See that? Nine and a half. What a beautiful fish. Okay, another fish on. Let's see what we have. I think it's another mandrel. Hey, oh, he looks legal. Beautiful fish. Beautiful mandrel snapper. See him? He looks legal. That's a nice looking mandrel snapper right there. Let's look at him. He's 11 inches. He's 11 inches. Beautiful mangrove snapper. Beautiful. Little Manatee River mangrove snapper. Beautiful fish. He's going in the cooler. Very good. Very nice. Looks like another legal mangrove snapper. I think I had one on hit on the other on the other rod too. Let me just put that down. But another nice mangrove snapper. It's hard to fish with two rods sometimes. There we go. Beautiful. Better be careful, they they can jump. He's probably about ten and a half inches. Measure them just to be sure. Yep, ten and a half. Right on the money. Very nice mangrove snapper. Little Manatee River mangrove snapper. Beautiful fish. Another fish on. Let's see what this is. Feels like a mangrove snapper. And it is. And is he legal? I don't think so. I mean, it's a nice looking fish. Let's see. Uh, he just makes it. Just makes it at uh, about nine and a half. Look at that. Almost ten. That's a common size you find out here on the Little Manatee River. Just like this. Beautiful fish, though. Let him go. This one is. Oh, look at this. There's a sheep head. Looks like he's. Looks like he got foul hook. Look at that. Little sheep head, foul hook. He's got to go back. He's too small. Way too small. I mean, he was biting, and then he got foul hook like that. Oh. Wow. There you go. Little tiny sheep head. Off you go. Well, here comes the rain. It's time to head. It's time to head in. But we got a, a couple of nice mangrove uh, snapper here. A ten and a half and eleven. Got them in the Little Manatee River. This is what it's all about, right here. We went out for sheep head, but we got mangrove snapper. Got them on live shrimp. So it's been a good day. There's a lot of rain out in the Gulf heading in, so it's almost ten o'clock. Got to head in. I thank you for watching. Look at this. What a what a beautiful fish. Isn't that beautiful? Excellent. That's how you do it. Sometimes you have to adjust for uh I went out for sheep head, got some smaller ones, little juveniles, a couple of nice mangrove snapper. They'll clean up good. Thank you for watching. Saltwater fishing Tampa. Let's head in and let's go fishing next time. Well, here comes the rain. It's coming down. There's more heading in from the Gulf, and that wraps up another edition of Saltwater Fishing Tampa. Thank you again, and happy fishing.